Welcome CRM crew, my name is Nick and in today's quick tutorial I'm going to be explaining how to use notifications in the HubSpot CRM. So once you log into HubSpot CRM of course you will come to the home screen. Now in order to manage and use and change settings for notifications what you need to do is go to the bell icon on the top right hand corner here. Now this is your notifications area, if you press that you'll get this pop up window on the right hand side and as you can see we get constant streams of notifications. Now we can filter our notifications by using the filter tab by archived, uh, sign, export, follow, submission, select all. We've also got actions as well where we can archive all and mark all as read. So let's say obviously you've gone through or you're not interested in reading all your notifications, just mark them all as read and then they will all be completed. You won't you won't have the number by the bell icon which can infuriate people um, but we can also change our notification settings now this is the most useful thing as we don't want to be receiving notifications for everything and anything that's going on in the HubSpot system as people will eventually stop paying attention so in order to change those settings use the cog on the right hand side here press the cog and then as you can see we have the tab down here that says what you get notified about now if you press expand all items you will be able to work through all of the various different notifications that you get as a result that um, as a result of changes in the hubspot system so you can just go ahead and tick and untick relevant things that you do and consequently do not want to receive notifications for inside of your hubspot system and then once you've made those changes, all you need to do is press the save button. Now, I appreciate there are a lot of different options here, but it is worth going through them just to just to make sure that you're not seeing useless pieces of information. You're only getting the most relevant data coming through the most uh, the most useful data that can allow you to make informed decisions on the business itself. So once you've done that, or if you do end up making any changes, just ensure you that you press the save button. And once you've done so, you will stop or consequently start receiving notifications for those changed settings. And that is how to use and change notification settings in HubSpot CRM. I hope this video has clearly explained how to use notifications in HubSpot CRM. If you do have any further questions, please drop me an email. My details are in the description below. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you shortly in the next video. Thank you and goodbye.